Different in Jesus Christ in tomorrow's gospel as Jesus was drawing near Jerusalem, so he saw the city and wept over it. So here, what we can understand is that, that Jesus was coming to the city or Jesus was coming to Jerusalem, but they were not realizing Jesus and they were not welcoming him or welcoming his vis visitation. So therefore, he had to will. He had to cry over the city, saying that uh, the enemies will build a wall, and then and then they will uh, smash your children, and so on. So these things will happen because you did not. Uh, they did not welcome the visitation of Jesus Christ. So in our lives, or in present context, we can see how the world is growing uh, technologically, and uh, there are a lot of uh, developments or progress had taken place in various various field uh, you can take in the computer how google is very active uh, google and then chat gpt so chat gpt is uh, you know anything uh, people want so they go and uh, type in the chat gpt and then they get the things so he, he, it, just imagine that if everyone is doing the same so you will get the same content you will get the same content and uh, this is technological development, uh, online or internet development. And there are other developments like uh, weapons. So how many varieties of uh, weapons uh, uh, each country is uh, making, is making varieties of weapon, uh, f uh, fighting jet and then missile and then uh, uh, bio weapon, bio weapon. So these are the uh, technology, uh, these are the developments that has taken place, that is happening it is for what? It is to destroy the others and uh, they say that it is for the safety of the country. And so, but then uh, if they are making this, such a things, such a thing to destroy others, so how can that bring peace? How can that bring peace? So it may bring to destruction. It may bring to, bring to destruction. So therefore, uh, amongst these, Amongst these, looking at these developments in the secular world, we should not be attached toward that. Attached towards that. So, people go for enjoying, people go for party, so they go for an enjoyment. And uh, we also go join them, thinking that this is the true joy. But that is not, maybe that is a joy for a moment. But then uh, the true joy is what Jesus will offer to us. So the true joy or the eternal joy that is with Jesus Christ. So therefore, we need to long for that joy, dear friends. So let us not be attached towards the worldly things, but let us attach ourselves to Christ. Thank you.